finals, which is another uh, PvP. Um, yeah, this is going to be a best of five with one point advantage to uh, Pop Hip as the uh, winner of the upper bracket. Um, this is Rain and Pop Hip uh, saying, uh, Pop saying, I don't want to play in the finals anymore. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> why did you learn from my fake cannon rush? Reality is saying. We, we actually haven't seen a real mirror build so far. If you think about it. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool in a, in a tournament that's pretty much all mirror matchups. We actually haven't seen any mirror builds. That's, uh, that, that's a pretty cool uh, thing, I think. Um, uh, 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 Okay, just, just, just aggressive. I'm just reminding the players about the uh, best of yeah, five. I could remind it earlier. Oh, okay. I just want to make sure. I gotta make sure. Shake. So, your brother in the face. A final Shea. match on Kairos. Kairos Junction. L E. Version 0.5. O point five, of course, stands for. Um... <clears throat> What's it and speaking of O point five, we have in the O point five in the bottom right hand corner of the map, spawning in the bottom right corner of the map, in the bottom right hand corner of the map of Kairos Junction. Off there for a second. Kairos Junction! L-E! L-E, of course, stands for... Lethargic! Energetic! Lethargic! Energetic! That's the name of my, um... Uh... Drink. My new alcoholic, isotonic, uh... <laughs> caffeinated... <laughs> A aimed at pugs. Uh, electrolyte drink. Aimed at pugs. We have in the bottom right corner map. So I need the bottom right corner map. In the bottom right corner map. Oh! The map. We have the. <clears throat> we have the blue Protoss. Representing the Mawa. Mm, Mawa short time. Yes, one point up in the series. He is the Saiyak Slayer. He is Pop Hip. And in the top left <laughs> corner map, so only in the top left corner map, we have the Red Protoss, <laughs> representing Winter Gaming Ladder Heroes and 200 IQ. We have the Red Protoss, if Pop Ever is the Saiyan Slayer, and Rain and Pals is the Saiyan Finisher. We have the Red Protoss, we have Rain and Pals. <laughs> I like that they started yawning in the middle of the sentence. <laughs> and it's an oh, yeah. uh, corner of the map. <laughs> Look, it's pre-bent nap time, so... <laughs> Gotta take a nap before you go to sleep, otherwise how how you'll be ready. Ooh, that's a yeah. that's a fairly early Twilight Council here for uh, Rain and Pals. We, do, we have seen Rain and Pals. He is almost on Nemesis' level of DT liking. He doesn't really proxy DTs, mm -hmm. but he does like them. Just sneaks him around, like, what are you doing? Uh, everyone you likes doing? DTs. Mmm, Sarah Tool, show me them the- Oh wait, that's to monetize. What? Sarah Tool's nipples. They got demonetized? For demonized? I don't know. I don't know, if the frickin' like, everything to a topsy-turvy, like, Tumblr is a thing. <laughs> like, everything is wrong with the world, like, Tumblr is a thing! 
<laughs> no, this did get in. Does that? No, they didn't. No, they didn't. Yeah. Clutch pylon. And they are right actually the going to die. No, they are re. They are going to die in reality. No, reality isn't here. Reality yeah, he is said. done. We're done with reality. We are in dreamland now. Ooh, the two finny, uh, finny, uh, the <laughs> they imaginary finishes. They pass each other, shoot each other, and then they're like, eh, whatever. Just like in real life. Eh? Oof. Eh? No, but reality's done. Yeah. All right. So it's gonna be blink it is. Uh, probably with a war prism. No, oh, getting in detection just in case. Yeah, rain and wild stuff. Um, I mean, if you want to, uh, I would, I, blink, I would uh, into the main from um, choice to blink into the main, but you can with an observer. Yeah, I think he wants to play it a little bit safe though. Like, be ready, ready for any aggression, and right in that, right in that window of opportunity, right in that one window, then he blinks into the main. Mm -hmm. It's, um... This really is starting to remind me of like 2014 Blink era of our swarm. BVB yeah. finals, both players getting a bunch of stalkers. It's like, yep. Well, Pop isn't actually going for a lot of stalkers as much. I mean, he's got more right yeah. now, but he's not getting any tech for them. Uh, oh, he's Blink. Well, he's just not getting the Twilight Council to bear, so. Yeah, mm -hmm. but, yep. Yeah. Oh, wait, Pop Hip, you meant. Yeah, pop. The one, the one I thought you said Rain and Palace isn't getting. Yeah, my brain. Look, I need. Let me get it's my post, nap. It's pre, it's pre bed nap time. Come on. <laughs> I have to take my nap or I can't sleep. Um. Hashtag Pog Life. Alright, let's see. Uh, Hello, Scout does coming see in. The, uh, the 4G does oh. He that. doesn't see the Twilight Archives. If Pop Hip has been watching Rain and Pals, he's likely thinking this guy likes ETs. Um. Yeah. I'm not sure what Pop Hip is actually. Uh, to be fair, though, Storm in PvP immortal. is not that common. Charge to Mortal and getting. Now he's getting the uh, toilet, not the toilet, the other console, the other uh, Templar Archives, I think. Templar Archives, think. Mean not the console. Yeah. They're not Templar Archives. They're not, uh, console. They're not DT Shrine, they're not, they're not Dark Shrine. Console. They're not the one that's not the Dark Shrine. The naming of these things is so confusing to me. <laughs> Look, you gotta, you gotta be in lore. Like, if it, like, this is how uncreative I am, everything would just be like, Yeah! High Templar Factory! Yeah, barracks factory. It's yeah, the it's a barracks Starport factory. Starport factory. It's a factory that makes barracks. -y. Barracks. -y. Barracks. -y. Yep. Barracks. -y. All right. Yeah. This is. This is started. This is a bit of a. This is a bit of a PVP. Seven minutes into the game. Yep. One probe did a couple of adepts and. and yeah. Yep. Yeah. Here's the thing about PVP. People say, yeah, no, it's. It's so much of like a, like a anything can happen, it's crazy. Well, the reason why players have played crazy anything can happen styles is because they know how boring it is for viewers, <laughs> for both players to macro. Um, yeah, and they're sympathetic to us. Yeah, like, yeah, gotta put it on a show. I mean, imagine if you, it's like, you take so long to actually build anything and get a, an economy going and macro up and get your bases and get your army and then it's just over and then like, Gotta do this again? So you're like, you know what? This is in a best Cannon of Rush. seven series? This is a game one in a best of seven. Let's just cannon rush and finish this. So this is just like playing, you know, rock, paper, scissors, basically. Just, let's just end this quickly. Yeah, it's like, alright, first game I'm gonna think a bit, uh, let's do scissors. Next game I'm gonna think a little bit, he went rock, I'll do, uh, he's gonna bluff, he's gonna do something, I'll kind of pick. Oh, yeah, I was thinking of Rainbow Pals. Rest of the game? Rock, 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 rock. Alright. Rock, rock, rock. Yeah, I see advantage for now. Pretty 
big warpin, but they are getting caught behind the Archons. There's a little bit of a choke. The Zelts are getting caught a little bit. Some of them starting uh... to seep through. Getting a little bit of a nice buffer. The Guardian Shield is actually not really helping Zelts. Yeah, the Shield Butters aren't, aren't ready yet for uh, Quapip. Yeah, those Charge Lots are getting into the uh, Stalkers and the Immortals there. Now they're going to start munching on probes. That's a okay. tremendous amount of damage. Yeah. And yep. I think, yeah, it looks like Rennet Bells evened up the score pretty quickly. GG. And I say quickly for... Screw your winner's advantage. Quickly for a Protoss, at least. Well, click quickly for a macro PvP. <laughs> yeah. Like, welcome to macro PvP. It's like both players build up and then we are, now... We are, so, we are so fucking spoiled when we think a 9 minute game <laughs> takes is a, is a long yeah. game. <laughs> Uh, and then you see th there's still those casts of those two hour long games from Heart of the Swarm where it's just like Turtle Terran versus late game Zerg. It's swarm it's just, yeah. uh, huh. That's not. Yeah, no. No. Oh, apparently we got hosted by KJ. Hey! Hi! KJ! Right. Why did the alarm alert not? Did the alert say something and I just missed it or uh, what happened? It's very possible. It's, <laughs> it is at all possible that I was not paying attention to what I was doing. Uh, all right, let's get the uh, players in. So we are, but we're, we're down to a best of three. I see. I told you we we're going to have another best of three PVP here. <laughs> 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 and you said now it's gonna be a best of five. See, now it's a best of three. No, it's still a best of five. Where it's just a we game two of this best of five, and I do mean. Game yeah, but two, they are sideways and, one one now, so it's a best of. Three yeah, but that doesn't. No, that doesn't make it a best of three. No, it doesn't. From now on, it is. Were, no, you you gotta fucking look back at the bracket and be like, yeah, that was a best of three. No, it fucking wasn't. There were four games played at least. Um, wait, no, we're not ready. Yaku, jumped again. <laughs> jumped in. Yeah, I made it to the finals. I'm gonna play random. Like, right. finally decided to rig a bracket for me. Right. And all it took was like. <laughs> all it took was all it took was still more fumbling the the uh, the lobby <laughs> interface. You know, to be fair, happens a lot. This is true. Uh, no, true isn't here. He's in Canada, I think, right now. Oh, yeah! He doesn't play in these kinds of... tournaments. Speaking of... Canada! We are in... where... Canada is. We are in... Automaton. L-E! L-E, of course, stands for... Look out! <laughs> emergency! <laughs> Look out, emergency! That's what happens when you're in Canada. <laughs> You've got, always got to be on the lookout. <laughs> in the 14 minute mark, spawning the 14 minute mark, in the 14 minute mark of Automaton. LE! We have the red Protoss! He has been up on top! The Slayer of Saex making it up into the Grand Finals with one point advantage. Of course, now it's not really a point advantage. We have three more games remaining, and um, it's not really a point advantage, really. We have the Red Protoss representing Showtime, the Mawa. We have Pop Hip. I, I almost did and... change your when you said Showtime. <laughs> And in the bottom, no wait, no, it's, let's see, 35, that's like 40-ish, that's 45, that's below 45, I'm gonna say 43 minute mark, in the 43 minute mark, oh, oh top, my ton. we have the blue Protoss, showing off that you can end the game relatively quickly with macro if you know how to hit timings, and that winner's advantage don't mean nothing, mate, winner's your winner's advantage. Let me let me just crush that like a 
bring this can. We are representing the 200 IQ of Winter Gaming Ladder Heroes. We have Rain and Pals. Alright. So no uh, no cannon rushes so far. This is the first, I think, standard TBC we saw we saw here. Where TBC? we have the two Adams versus two stalkers. <laughs> TBC? Oh. You just desire TBC so much, you're like... Did I say TBC? Yeah. <laughs> okay, so you're it's just, actually... You it's just a... want a TBC so much, you just want something not <laughs> protest. This is... And you're like, yeah, TBC. Actually, Popip has a... Uh, um, hidden a pylon and a probe inside yeah, Rainbow Bell's space. Uh, so, base. not as standard as I was... <laughs> Getting that. Oh uh, my lord, I can't wait. Oh my lord. Right inside. Ooh. He's pulling a dally right now. Yeah, so no, That's again, we're, we're, we're crushing it. It's a complete PvP tournament with no mirror builds. Look at that. He's gonna go to bed now. <laughs> okay, do I just go in? Uh, recalls, but. That was an interesting glitch. Okay, and that uh, added up to uh, so six see points. The pylon. It's gonna be a dark shrine. All of a sudden, his probes are gonna die, and be like, "What? Oh, yeah." I don't think so you can wait. You can't ah, wait. That's what Twilight Council you anymore. can't wait for a dark shrine with this kind of thing. You can if you're dear. Oh, and the shield battery as well. Uh... Okay, Poppy is moving out. Which might uh it's going okay, to pop. It's just about Rain done. Pa Did Rain Pass spot the didn't spot Oh no, he's gonna can't have He's going to be uh such a genius multi prong. Yeah Such a good multi prong Stalkers are in there oh, we look go. At your surprise! surprise. Yes. Right Ooh. in your eye. I'm what's it called? Leapfrogging my shield batteries! Striking He's literally my... from the shadows! Hello, boy. Oh, boy. GG is called! <laughs> you thought you could even up my winner's advantage? My winner's advantage? Hell no! Nah. This is my winter's advantage. No, uh, winner's No, winter's. Wait, which one is the winter? No, Puffy is Rain no. It didn't work. It right. didn't work. The pun did. The pun did not work. Abort. Abort. Uh, the winter's advantage. All right. Uh, next map. Let's see what uh, our next map is going to be. It's going to be blue shift. So we had Kairos, Automaton, and now blue shift. Yep. Going back to a bit of more old school, and by old school, I mean it was in the last ma uh, map pool. And and the previous like three map pools as well. Uh, no, it wasn't. No, yes, it was. it was. Blue Shift is new. It's like last two map pools. There was also a thing called Catalyst before that. Huh? Remember that? No. Catalyst. Catalyst. Oh, oh, now it's Kairos Junction. No, it's Blue Shift. Just because it changes, no. just because it changes its color and name, doesn't mean it's not the same thing. Look, you gotta, you have to be supportive, Steel. Like, no, I am supportive. He, I am supportive. No, you have to be, I'm just yeah, saying, like, it's he not. He wants to, he, he, like the map wants to, like he, the map doesn't want to be called Catalyst anymore. I'm not calling it's, it Catalyst. I'm just saying it's still the same. The new identity. It's, you I'm, gotta be supportive. It's, I am supportive of the new identity. The I am supportive of the new identity. I just don't appreciate. De denying the old identity. Well, yeah. You, got, you gotta, you know, gotta reconcile know. everything. Oh, 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 them both. You can't, you can't just Look. leave that. Yeah, but I mean, blue shift. If that's what it's going on by now, blue shift. You know, it's going. It's it's a difficult time for it. Like it's a confusing time for it. Seal. I still don't like the way it betrayed red shift. <laughs> Well, it comes back to this. If you if you want to go with a new identity, at least make something of your own. Make something of yourself. Don't don't just go and just take someone else's name, like that. 
I feel like you're telling that to everyone who called themselves Steel Something. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag hypocrisy. Or you're speaking to Kuro. Or you're speaking to Kuro. Who... <laughs> and by Kuro, I mean the Afri the one on Africa Freaks. Stole Swixie Squad's name. <laughs> And speaking of Africa freaks, we have on the top right corner map. So I need the top right corner map. Oh, blue shift. L E L E of course stands for. Yeah. Lanky. Outvoke. No, that's A. Lanky. <laughs> Yeah. Empanada. Oh, fair empanada. enough. Empanada. Yeah, lanky empanada. That's when it's like, you know, it's pretty long and um, you think it does have like the filling spread out, but it's like in a weird proportion. So it's like, why would I eat this? It's like, I can just dip the dough in empanada filling. And so that's, that actually sounds pretty good. <laughs> hmm. What was the talking Stop about? Stop making me hungry. Dinner? Well, ooh. Oh, oh yes! In the top left corner of the map, in swanning in the top right corner of the map, in the top right corner of the map, oh, blue shift. We have the blue Protoss. He's the one that chose blue shift. He's like, yeah, it's like, pretty good. It's starting to come together. He is representing the 200 IQ of Winter Gaming Ladder Heroes. We have the blue Protoss. We have Rain and Bad. And in the bottom left hand corner map, swatting the bottom left hand corner map, we have the red Protoss. He is representing Showtime, but I think he played a bit more like Deer last game. We have the red Protoss. We have Pop Hip. Look at the Mauer. Mm -hmm. yeah, there's still this probe running cool. around here. Mostly looking for rain and bells, uh, proxies and such. Uh, this is the first time we're getting a mirror. I think. Is it Twilight? Right, I'm gonna take a nap. And Twilight. Blanket already. Council from uh, rain and bells. Uh, and the Nexus from hip hip hop top hip hip hop. Hmm. Like, uh, reality taught us today, you don't expand in PvP. <laughs> <laughs> well, in NA PvP, this is EU versus AU. Well, I, I mind fa fair enough, you're right. But while well, we are playing it in, in the middle, they kind of, you know, it falls on US, right? Yeah, and you could argue that ever since the servers got merged, AU slash Oceania slash C is basically adopted by NA. Alright, so uh, Rain and Pass does see, uh, sorry, Poppy does see Rain and Pass stalkers. I'm gonna be prepared here for, uh, for this little uh, assault. Shouldn't be doing uh, anything. Uh, yep, there we go. Both of them, good. Yeah, both of them getting the, the second Nexus. See, a robotics facility coming up for uh, Rain and Pals. Um, Puffy Paul already has his setup. You're going to see Rain and Pals going to Blink Stalkers again. Uh, he's going to try the same trick. I'm, I'm hoping he's going to try the same trick because you can also uh, do the, the uh, similar. Uh, um, Non nonsense shenanigans here, uh, but you, no, wait, you don't. I mean, you can. I mean, what I'm saying, I mean, you can blink into the uh, main from those, those corners. But uh, then I remember that Poppy actually built a gateway stuff. Yeah, inside Venom Palace's base. It's a little too late for that. Uh, Observer, gonna see the army moving out. I'm just yes. gonna let you handle this while I just get. My bearings. They have uh, stalkers and more stalkers. 
Yep. I mean, no blink yet. Rain 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 is, Rain is, is getting blink, blink and an earlier uh, plus one. Mortal. Plus one. Yeah, weapons. yeah, plus one as well. Uh, but and they're both getting with the same composition. She's immortal stalker. Well, pop is starting to get. Okay, now rain and pulse. Yep, this is this is the blue mirror. Mm-hmm. Finally, we have a mirror matchup, a proper mirror match mirror matchup. So I guess we just uh, wait for the next twelve minutes before. They <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm just looking at this game going. Like, um, yeah, I'm gonna, gonna be a while. Well, okay, you can definitely get sneaky on this map. As we said, that's a massive main. You can go around with, you know, have your observers in place, go around, try to deny expansions wherever you can. Uh, uh, but it looks like both players are more than content to just get started there. Uh, Temporal Archives then cancelled it and I'll start it again. Yeah. yeah. It's a little weird. It's all good. So look, it's all good. It's all good, man. Right. So let's say if they are going to opt for uh, going a little bit more macro and getting a third base bidding up, or is one two base all in. Go to Double two base all in. Let's go, Al. Let's go. Right, uh, I mean, Venipaz is getting more gateways and Archon, so this might just be it. Yep, and Pophip is getting ready to get his third. He's not gotten it yet, but he's setting it up su such that he can get his cannons when his Nexus is down. So he gets a little bit of that buying time. Um, Pophip has some good vision on the map. Get oh, is that? Oh, that's... I thought for a second it was Pophip's pylon. I got, so I got excited. I got excited there for a second. <laughs> You're so enthralled by last game, like he's doing it again. Oh, no, no, no. Nope. <laughs> yeah, I think a pop people will be ready if Rain and Pass moves out. Um, I think. Um, I think pop people will be the one moving out though. They're both like actually going for the same thing. They have the same. Buildings. It's a mirror. Yeah. It's, 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 look at the, the buildings. They have this, this almost exact same amount of buildings. As soon as it these uh, four gateways are finished. It is said that the mirror... Oh, Alright, now we see something different. A Robo Bay from Rain and Pals. Tell mm. me it's Disruptors. I want Disruptors. Give me... Hey. I love the new Disruptors, I gotta say. Uh, they are pretty damn cool. They're well, they're the cool. old Disruptors. They're but... the old Disruptors, to be honest. The hashtag the original flavor. Um, oh yeah, they're they're both going for third bases and just staying at home. Mm, yep, pop it a little bit sooner, but yep. Again, nine minutes into the game, one stalker dead, uh, three probes. That's. Winnipeg is change. definitely getting ready for his push though. <laughs> just like get two, three adepts, adepts. No, disruptors in there. He's gonna push, move out. Mm -hmm. Yep, here they come. More than likely. Chronoing him out. He's got his weapons ready, of course. It's not really gonna help his disruptors, but the disruptors on your own help a ton, so. <laughs> um, Renard Paz ahead in terms of uh, upgrades, slightly ahead. Depending on. Uh, yeah, he's got it. his plus three started. You both have plus two now. Oh, well, actually, they started at similar times. Mm, yeah. But those disruptors, that's the, that is key. That's the key. I mean, how are they doing in terms of. Yeah, the same amount of Archons, same amount of Immortals, same amount of Zealots. <laughs> it's just. Finally, we're there's getting like a proper mirror. It's like an AI copying its opponent. Yeah, except Renan right. Pals doesn't have a warp prism while Pop Pip does. That oh, could, that could be way, a very. Uh, oh, uh, right, he's getting one now. So, there's. There's my analysis. But for this the push, though, it's not. I mean, it's not with the push, though. So, you can go with that. One disruptor uh, could make the difference if you get some good shots in. Of course, if he fumbles the shots, then that's <clears throat> wasted supply, essentially. Mm -hmm. okay, uh -huh. Let's start starting to see it. There's a similar one, but you do, uh, getting a little bit of a rumble right there. Game. But now the two main armies are starting to clash. Nice little disruptor shot, and quite a bit. 
Yeah, so let's get out. to the immortals of uh, Poppy Ben. Look at the army supply dropping on the on our raid Protoss. Uh, and these Zealots actually aren't doing the greatest damage. Um, not well, starting now they're starting to ramp up some uh, kills, but uh, so does Brandon Palace on the uh, Poppy side of the map. Yeah. GG is called. Have ourselves an ace match. So this is a pretty good, yo. This is a sideways do and do, ladies and gentle ducks. So now you can't consider it a best of three because four games are played. No, now it's a best total. of one. No, you can't fucking. You we can't. Cause first of all, you can't fucking. Okay, just in general, you can't fucking. You should be careful. <laughs> Gotta watch out of, for yourself. Kids, you can't fucking. You, but you can't fucking. Not kids. It's a PSA. D no, no, Yaku, no. Everyone watching at home. Kids you and can. fucking separate, separate. We do do not condone that. Stasis is our next map. Thank you, Poppy, for saving us from this <laughs> god awful conversation. Um, <laughs> Renan Pass is responding with yuck. Why? <laughs> Gives us the ace match. Thank you, Poppy. Ah. <laughs> Poppy is answering because. Cyclops. Hashtag Cyclops face. Alright. So this is our ace match on Stasis Ward. Why Stats Ward. Why is it called a Stasis Ward? Blizzard Lord Team would like to know your location. RDY? RDY? Ready. Let's go. I don't understand all this teen slang. Like, okay, why is Kuro giving us angry face now? She's not communicating with us. She's just giving us <laughs> anger and and stress and no communication, zero communication. That is not effective. Right? That is not effective administration. Right. Speaking of administration, we actually we, we, we actually have to do this. Yo. <laughs> we actually have to do this. And speaking of effective administration, we have over here on Stasis L E. L E of course stands for lingering expulsion. Lingering expulsion. That's when you say, "Be gone, foul demon." But the demon's like, um, oh, that's I mean, exorcism. And um, not explosion. I'm sorry. No, no. The demon's like, look, I'm, 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 look, I'm, I'm sorry, I came here on your outside, right? But can I like just, just a couple more days, right? Just till I get on my feet. And you're like, fine. And so the demon just lingers there, even after you've expelled them. And the Top right hand corner of the map, spawning in the top right hand corner of the map, we have the blue. Blue? Blue. Blue? Blue. Because it was like the other way around last time where one of them was red, one of them was blue, but this time it's like, yeah, I don't know, that's like game pack. It's just so good. It's just so good. It's just so It's like, one of them was blue, the other one was blue. It's just so good. What's happening? We have the blue Protoss representing the Mawa Showtime. He is the blue Protoss. What's in? He had his winner's advantage. He has winner's advantage taken away. He took another game. And now we're in the ace match. We have Pop Hip. And in the top left hand corner of the map, so I need to left hand corner of the map. Red this time, for a change. Pretty, pretty festive. We have the Red Protoss, representing the 200 IQ of Winter Gaming Ladder Heroes. We have, he said, screw your winner's advantage. Then he said, oh, maybe I should respect your winner's advantage. And he said, nope, screw your winner's advantage again to bring it up into the ace. We have the Red Protoss. Everyone give it up for Rain and Bows. Nine. 
and we've seen some pretty crazy games on this map so far. Um, this one doesn't look like it. Well, I just did a list. I do uh, and start gets coming up from Puppy, and and which is pretty good on this map because you have all this. Uh, yeah, it's a fairly short rush distance by air. Yeah, all this. Thingy thingies. I mean, the pathing could be a little crap around here sometimes, but <laughs> still. Well, uh, I mean, it's, it's once you get map. used to it, you can abuse it. But then, of course, once you get used to it and abuse it, your opponents are going to start to get used to their opponents abusing it. So then, you got like, to get used to I like the pro of blocking the uh, stalkers. And stalkers do not get into the main. Yeah, we'll yeah that probably stop it. Yeah, the Oh, no cancel. Oh, already right end. Noise. Uh yeah, and Pop Up is uh, quick to fast. follow with the uh, uh, Nexus as well. Uh and it's going to be an oracle. Yeah, in just a second. Again, short air rush distance. Yeah. Let's see the padding from Oh, does get scouted. Oh, scouted. And these stalkers are already out. They can go into position. Oh, they're not going in position. Uh, they're going back into position. Well, they are. Uh, oh, but they're not in position now. It's going to go oh, towards going the in uh, southwest corner. Thingy thingy. Yep, a little bit less predictable considering just do what the map tells you to do and your opponent will expect it, so you know. Mm hmm. Right. Right. Oh, the suckers are in position. Oh, they're moving into position. Oh, but they're not in position now. Oh, they're in position. Oh, they're getting uh, more. Oh, oh, get the out. Oracle Ooh. goes down. Just one probe dead there. They were in position. Yeesh. Let me tell you. Yep. <laughs> you, you did. You, you did tell me. Did I? <laughs> Several times, yeah. Huh. Alright. So. Yeah, the stalkers were in position there to uh, deny the oracle. Yeah, we see Twilight Council again from uh, Pop Hip. Does get scouted by uh, Ren and Paz hallucinated phoenix. This time uh, Ren and Paz going for a blink stalker again. Progressive blink stalkers, yep. He's getting this blink. Can be done right when they pop in. Can be able to do that fancy blink micro. Mm. Yeah, they actually good. Quite close before they get scouted. Ooh, they're gonna get a sentry. That's a nice and back catch. off. And back in. Alright, five versus four. No. I, I kinda wanted them to get that probe. Just cause two to be. Oh cool. well. <laughs> um Okay, another Oracle for a pop hit. It's a nice utility unit. You wanna replace it if you lose one. Um, yeah. I mean, that's uh, uh, sorry, I just process, right. Would you rather have the utility of an oracle, or would you rather spend your minerals and gas on tech or whatever? Um, no, no. It's a, it's a nice question. Sometimes it works. Look, figure it out your own. Figure out your own. Damn. It's not, it's not a like, job to tell like... you how to play the game. Damn you! I was coming in here. Expecting advice from people who have no idea what they're doing. What are you talking about? We just see the game, we, we, we crack some jokes, have some fun. That's the job. And then we go to, and then we take a nap, and then we go to bed. Yeah, take a nap, then we go to bed. Uh, I might eat a late lunch though. I need to eat. Okay, double uh, Oracle coming in, but there's some stalkers to uh, intercept that. There's no revelation or reveal on the tech though. This time a little bit more damage done in this game, but it looks like they're both settling into another uh, little more macro more game. We yeah. haven't really seen a really big macro. I mean, still so one game that kind of meandered. Uh, the others were uh, yeah. they were abusing some timings here and there. Oh, it's like Ren is again. 
There's a rush. There is a land rush distance, but he has to clear the debri debris. Mm, yeah. Just, Not in debris. Just, uh, wait, does he have a. Uh... Yeah, he's getting warpism. All the oracles. They do revel at the army, so that's all helpful. Uh, Prevents. Yeah. Prevents uh, random paths from moving out without well, yeah, knowing. Just for the next few minutes. Stasis ward on stasis! Oh my oh, god, you did the thing! Oh, the, yeah, the inevitable thing that was going to happen regardless. And In a PvP, special. yeah, it's like. No, special doesn't usually play pro to us. Uh, Renip has also a heading upgrade, should, uh, should note. Heading army, a heading upgrade. Yep. Uh, if he's on top of it, he gets plus three right now, he's gonna have such a huge lead. I mean, but he has to move out soon, because Poppy has a third base, way ahead in work account, and getting a header. Um, a header? A header, more a header. Actually, no, stop. Like uh, in soccer? Uh, football? No, actually, I didn't stop. I was looking at the wrong kind of color. <clears throat> I think my voice is... Uh, He's dying. They're moving out now! 71 supply versus uh, 51. Let's go. Rampals has to do at least economic damage, if not kill him outright. I do think he's going to be able to kill him outright. He has the upgrade lead for quite a bit. He has the army lead. Ah, uh, let's get scouted. But... Rain and Pals is just massive right now. Yep, that's, a lot of that is in uh, Stasis charge Wars, though. though. Are in Observer will have to see this and not get sniped out. Yeah, sees one, not oh, the other though. They gotta be able to get oh, it. Does see the other? Oh, blinks uh, right on top. That's pretty noise. smart. Better not risk it. Yeah, that's Better very risky. Eh? Risk it. Eh? No, risky place to work. Yeah. The jokes. And two oracles, two oracles get into the uh, natural here. There's some one shot probes. Don't, don't do shield battery. They don't do no nothing. Uh, Rain Pals gonna put a bit of a melty prong. Charge looks in the natural, yeah. Yeah. And the I think we're about clash. to see the end of this game. The armies clash, but this is a choke point. Yeah, I thought he was losing all a lot. Ram Pals' armies are attacking, but yeah, as you said, Poppet just losing about losing army supply. Ah, uh, and, and yeah, and Rain Pass killed a hell of a lot more workers. So now they are even on worker count. Rain Pass still has the army advantage. The shield batteries are going to help Pop if, uh hold here. Not for long. The Archons are coming in. The Chargelets cleaning out the natural. Yeah. And now this one Chargelet from back home just like, hey, who knows the fight? There you have it, Rain Pals! Coming in from the shadows! From the lower bracket! Coming right uh, back in! It, it was taken out by reality. But then. He, who, was reality, taken, he, who was taken out by Pip Pop Pip? Who was taken out by Pop Pip? This, this is a full portal circle. <laughs> I mean. <laughs> It was Reality took out Rain and Pals, Pop Hip took out Reality, Rain and Pals took out Reality, Rain and Pals took out Pop Hip, so. Yeah, we have. Yeah. We have, we have uh, reality taking out uh, Rain and Pals, who then uh, climbed back. Reality was taken out by Pop Hip. I'm just uh, doing a, a, a recap on screen because it looks, it looks real great and stupid. Actually, don't see anything. It just looks glitchy as crap. Let's not do that. All right, everyone. Well, this is uh, this is the end of our uh, tournament for today. Four and a half hours, not bad, considering it's double elimination. <laughs> that could go on forever. Um, congratulations to Rain and Pals, who uh, for his second SDO uh, championship. Debatable. No, it's not debatable. At all. Debatable, but... Oh, not we'll debatable not, we'll not get into at all. That. We'll not get and into that on screen. And also, this time, 
he gets it without any uh, any disqualifications. He gets it all on his own. Um, so yeah, second uh, SDO championship. Don't take it. Don't take it away from him. He works hard on both of these. Come on. Come on. Come on. Anyway, uh, I would like to thank our uh, admins for today. Uh, that would be the 16th Squad Sanseki, otherwise known as Kuro, otherwise known as Group, Hero of the Wasteland and Savior of Esports. Um, also, Light VIP, hashtag Light MVP, our team captain and uh, admin extraordinaire, also supplier of the prize money for today's tournament, uh, which will go to uh, Rain Bells. Uh, also, like to thank the Pog Chop himself, Yakuzaku. Yaku, hey, hey, Yaku, Yaku, Yaku. I just want to eat, man. I haven't eaten please. since 11, 8, 12 hours ago. Okay, please tell everyone very quickly where they can find more of you. Twitch.tv slash cranky underscore ducklings. Twitter.com at Emperor Yakuzaku. Find me on Discord. You can join our Discord. And yeah, I can... Look, please, I'm, I'm not an admin, so any questions and queries, please do not PM me. Go into like VIP or Kuro. Uh, buy my shirts. And uh, I am Steel Mold, and uh, you can find me at twitch.tv slash Steel Mold, where uh, tomorrow, myself and this other strapping yard lad here, Yakuzaku, will be discussing our uh, movie club of the week, weekly, monthly, monthly thing, probably, we, we should, monthly. we should, probably, uh, where we are going to discuss the movie Robocop from 1984? I think something like that. 89? Pretty damn good movie. Which Yaku hasn't seen yet. Um, I saw the it's my recommendation. Yep. Um, so come and join us. And that will be all from us for today. Well, we're going to find someone interesting to host uh, after this. And. Uh, yeah, we're going to leave you with some uh, dying zealot ASMR for your appreciation. Goodbye. Ah! <laughs> 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 <laughs>